Roll-wrapped carbon fiber tubing is a great process for low-volume technical layup jobs and can be scaled for high-volume productions to make carbon fiber tubing. Roll-wrapped tubes can come in several shapes including round, oval, square, rectangular, hexagonal, and octagonal. They can be made using carbon fiber, fiberglass, Kevlar, natural flax fibers, or any combination of each that are pre-impregnated with epoxy resin called prepreg. To make a tube using the roll wrapping process, the prepreg fiber is taken out of a freezer which keeps the resin system from curing. The material is left at room temperature for up to four hours so it becomes easy to work with. The prepreg is taken to the cutting area where a pattern cutting CNC table cuts it. The prepreg has a backing paper or film on one side to prevent the fibers from sticking to themselves on the roll as well as to the table surface before rolling. The fibers are cut at different directions in order to give the tubes optimal strength. A kitting station takes the cut layers of prepreg fibers and arranges them in the sequence that they will be rolled onto steel mandrels used to form the size and shape of each tube. The backing paper is labeled, which the worker uses to ensure that the sequence and sizes are correct. The roll wrapper uses detailed work instructions that help her roll the tubes correctly. The steel mandrel has been cleaned and prepped using special mold release to prevent the prepreg from sticking to it, and it is placed inside of a warming oven so that the first layer of material sticks to it. The prepreg is placed onto the mandrel with the fibers face down and the backing paper removed. The rolling table applies pressure as it rolls the material removing air as it does so. Each layer is rolled with the fibers at different directions and she makes sure that the material is straight on the mandrel. All of Rockwest Composites tubes can come with a standard fabric or cosmetic outer layer. After all of the layers for the tube are rolled, the mandrel is taken to the cello wrapping machine which wraps it with plastic tape. The first layer of tape provides a release for the next layers of tape. These tape layers contain the resin during the curing stage and compacts the material to make a thin, dense wall and a strong tube. The tube is now hung in an oven with other wrapped tubes where the high temperature hardens the epoxy resin. The rate of cure is determined by the type of resin system used in the prepreg materials. After curing, the mandrels and tubes are allowed to cool until they can be handled safely. They are taken to a machine that extracts the mandrel that the carbon fiber is wrapped around using hydraulic pressure. Next, the tube is taken to a rack with a motorized rod to automatically remove the plastic tape, which leaves a slight texture on the surface. The tube is now ready to be inspected and stored for shipping. Rockwest Composites offers custom cutting, sanding, and machining services for our customers, allowing them to buy what they want. Lengths cut up to 48 inches can be cut to very tight tolerances using special equipment to verify length. Lengths over 48 inches are cut using standard measuring equipment. We offer sanding services to achieve a smooth finish on your tube, which is suitable for painting. And tubes can be machined by one of our vendors for special fittings and assemblies. Rockwest Composites roll wrapping process is quick, clean, and produces high-quality composite tubes, making us your one-stop composite destination.